Welcome back to Bourbon Country Reacts. I'm Keith. That's Dustin. That's a bribe. We are. That's a bribe. That's a bribe. What we has here? Ace is high. How are we not doing an Iron Maiden song to this? <laughs> because Melody wanted a country song. Because but Iron Maiden, Ace is high. Would, if you don't know the song, it would fit because you guys are, are country fans largely. I think. Yeah. Um, go find a lyrics uh, video. That's a really good plan of Iron Maiden's "Ace Is High." It's one of the best songs ever written. Um, this I think is probably has nothing to do with Iron Maiden because it's actually got a card player on the the bottle. Um, so Melody has. Well, she didn't request it specifically with this bottle. She sent us a bunch of bottles. She sent us a bunch of songs. We're putting them together, and based on the title, I think I like this already. What? The title, well, it's Erica Joe, who I've never heard of, and never. the title is I Break Things. Accurate. I <laughs> Y'all have heard, have I told the joke on channel? I don't Marine think you joke? have. Yeah. But you put a Marine in a room, so lock it with three bowling balls? If you lock a Marine in a room with three bowling balls and wait two hours. Two, why does it take so long? Hey, man. We worked that trade. So, two hours later, one bowling ball will be lost. One will be broken, because we break things. And one will be pregnant. So Yes, you heard him correctly. A bowling ball will be pregnant. Marines break things. It's it's known. It is known. What's that from? Is that a Game of Thrones thing? It, uh, is, known. it is known. I think that's Mandalorian. Yeah, it might be. All right. So anyway, um, let's check out this song. I break things, and I hope it's about breaking lots of things. I like that. <laughs> Start for breaking a plate. Is this the country version of Oops, I Did It Again? Why? Why? Why did you have to go and do that? <laughs> the question seems legit. You're a dick. But yes, I think it is. Okay. <laughs> Just checking. I break things. Tougher than an anvil, oh baby, we'll see. And I'm like a wrecking ball coming. You're better off running far away from me. Don't get me wrong, now baby, I adore you. It's only right that I give you fair warning. Cause I pay things, anything I touch. Yeah, I make things snap and 
really bad playing. Apart. Catchy, kind of funny tune. I can see our woman's liking it. I can too, but I've never really understood the popularity of chicks bragging, I'm cray cray. Well, so that's. (laughs) You kind of, you stole my thunder there a little bit. (laughs) Don't you kind of wish they came with a warning? You know, that's a good point. And she should get some credit. (laughs) Right. For saying right up front, I'm cray cray. Yeah. I'm going to do irrational shit. Every time. The warning is nice. Right. That's what I'm saying. Okay, I've come around on the song. Like, wouldn't it be cool if they just came with a warning? This doesn't happen, guys. <laughs> they don't come with a warning. I mean, they do. You just don't see them until it's too late. My, my personal history suggests that they will keep a wrapper on all the cray cray. <laughs> no. Until was, you're bought in good enough. It was there. And then the cray cray comes out. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I do like that she's given a warning. Like I say, fun, catchy tune. And now I like the song because... It's a warning. It, she's being honest about it. <laughs> That's refreshing. Country, oops, I did it again. <laughs> what a dick. <laughs> Kind of fits though. Yeah, it kind of does. It kind of uh, does. Sorry. No, you're not. No, I'm not even a little lie. bit. That was a dirty <laughs> a lie. Bit. Like, you were lying through your teeth. I was. I'm sorry. sorry. <laughs> um, no. <laughs> no. I no, wasn't. he wasn't even a little bit sorry. So, what do you think of this He says hi stuff? I don't know why, but. I feel like I'm getting Ryan everything tonight. So for me, I take a sip of that. I set the glass down and I go, it's bourbon. Yeah. Right. Like it, there's, it's not complex. Nope. It's not bad. Corn sweetness. Yep. Um, corn in the mid. Yep. Corn in the finish. Almost no oak. Mm, very little. And the one thing I am getting in the finish that, frankly, given the way the rest of the drink uh, flows, I'm getting a touch of cinnamon on the finish that feels like it shouldn't be there. Yeah. It's it's like... It's not bad. It's good. But it's like, where'd this come from? What, why are you here? Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so this this is a pretty sticks. basic drink. It kind of sticks there for a minute. It, it does. Yeah. Um, and you're like, what? There's really nothing negative to say about this. There's yeah. not much good to say about it. But for a pretty, well, let's see if there's an age statement on it. That looks like two years at best. So Aces High Bourbon Whiskey. Uh, Guarantee it's 80 proof. It is, uh, it is exactly 80 proof. Mm-hmm. There's no age statement on the bottle. So it's got to be four. Allegedly. Unless they're doing it wrong. Which, mm. maybe they're... Because that does not look like four. Look how light that is. And it's... it so, so... But char level and... I mean, there, there are a lot of reasons it could be light. So you're right. And so here... All right, so so this is what happened with this bottle. What happened was, somebody got a hold of this bourbon and said, I bet we could sell this to 22-year-olds. Look at it. Yeah. I suspect. Bottled by Mike Curfee Distillery, LLC. So one dude. Spring Valley, California. Four... Benny Enterprises, Inc. That doesn't sound even a little bit sketchy. El Cajon, California. 
distilled in California. Okay. Well, it does not have a bad water taste. Right. So, like I say, there's nothing negative to say about this. Except for it came from California. There's not a ton of positive to say about it either. Yeah. So, you know, if it, I have no idea what this costs. If it's 20 to 25 bucks, go for it. Yeah. If it's much more than that, though. Mm, pass. Yeah. It just doesn't have anything that jumps out and says, this is great. Right. And there's right. so much that's like $30 that you're like, ah. All day long, I'll take a case of this, I'll take a case of that. That's not, this is not a buy by the case. It did pull me back to the glass. Um, I think it's that cinnamon finish. Yeah. That, that does it. So, guys, if you enjoyed this video, give us a like. Go ahead and subscribe. Drop down in the comments. Tell us what country music we need to check out. Tell us what North American whiskeys we need to try. Hey, till next time, guys. See ya.